all right guys welcome back to stuck on an island where i'm stuck with you guys and we are always smiling um currently the time is now what time is it it's now 10 30. i had initially planned to be out here at 11 but i was like yo maybe 11 o'clock is too pushing it you know too late at night but yeah i'm just trying to live like you know how the people do here in Cancun. you know the real way and the night you get hungry you want some food you go out to the block you know and go ahead and get something um how do i feel do i feel scared i know i keep mentioning this in the video because some people a lot of people have you know perceptions about Cancun. so um i'm just gonna spit it how i see it i uh, know it feels as i said it feels kind of like jamaica in some kind of way it feels like america too in the same way and um yeah um it's pretty chilly right now but not cold like i can't even explain it there's some warmth to the air right now and um yeah just to get out to where I'm going, it's maybe, uh, it's about a three minute walk. You won't be able to hear the wind on my camera because I'm using another camera that has a wind muff, so that's good. I'm um, in the vlog before, you would have been hearing um, you know, the sounds and stuff. And um, yeah, those dogs barking just reminds me of when I'll be walking past some yards in Jamaica and like the mongrel dog, they make woolly pot nice, you see me? Um, as you might realize on the streets now there's still there's still a good amount of activity at 10 30. people are still out driving their cars um i don't know i don't oh, people are even playing basketball too i don't even know the industriousness of of cancun i don't i, qu I don't quite know you know if it's like a new york or whatever it is but the people are still out and i'll just i'll ask the host tomorrow you know or whenever you know, what do people really do around here? Is it like mostly, um, you know, the hotel scene or what? Um, I don't know. <laughs> if I'm to be honest with you, this guy, he's riding a bike and he keeps clapping something. And at first I was like, yo, who's making that noise or are they trying to call out to me? So I stopped and I looked behind me. I was like, what the hell is that? I don't know. I checked the bike out. I don't know what he's selling or what he's doing, but there's still a clapping noise. It's almost like when the, the ice cream man in Jamaica is on um, riding his bike past and he goes, pecker, pecker, pecker. That sound was a lot more intimidating, to be honest. But yeah, I'm almost where I need to get to. And I do see a few people heading towards it too, maybe. All right, so I finally got to where I wanted to get to. I'm telling you that the food smells so good here. It smells really good. Um, I think I'm gonna start out trying to probably do the, the hot dogs first. I'll do the hot dogs today. Let me see what's up with that. <laughs> Which is a nice hot dog over here? Mm. What is the best? Pitbull. Pitbull? Yes. Pitbull and the bulldog. The bulldog is a jumbo, a big hot dog. Alright, I'll this go. Is the, this is the bread. Look. That one. And then another one that feels good is the. Enseñale un normal. Mira, look, this is the pitbull. That plate. Okay. Oh, that the one that the lady has? The pitbull? Yes, yes. <laughs> Jamaica water, horchata. Huh? Horchata. I don't know how to say it in English. How do they say it in English? It's the same horchata. Horchata, it's the same. We have milk and vanilla. Actually, it's nice. You would love it. Yeah, traditional. Yeah, traditional. This one? Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, I'm going to eat tamarindo. So, I'm having a pit bull. Pit bull hot dog. And... 
Conchata. Right. Sounds good. And uh, here is my Pitbull hot dog. Oh, this looks really good. Alright, I'm going to try this and tell you guys what I think about it. Tomato? Right. Cool, thank you. Alright, so you made me taste this. This is um, Cameroon sauce. It's a little bit sweet, it's a little bit spicy. We all know what Cameroon sauce is. And, uh, it's kind of hard to video. Yeah. To video and do it, but I'll try. Right, so I added uh, the, the chili pepper and thing, some onions, tomatoes. Pickle and a little bit more of this sauce. It looks really good. Yo, there are people still out here still eating. So that's a good sign. Oh my god, my juice here. How much? Yo, this is super difficult. <laughs> trying to video this with this whole big old camera and try the food at the same time. But um, let's see, I'm gonna try this. Let's drink and tell you guys what I think. Super good. It tastes almost like um, carrot juice, like the milky one. You'd love this. Definitely. I like that. Alright. Now let me try this. This pipple. This pipple. Matter of fact, let me take a picture for my Snapchat real quick. Alright, let's see. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's good. It's super good. Man, this is a very it's a Pretty small hot dog, but I had to stretch my mouth like so far. To put everything in, it's super good. You guys could tell like I just took a shower because my face was all dried out because of the hot water. But yo, it's not your normal hot dog, that's for sure. <laughs> it's super good. She did recommend this one. She recommended um this one, another bigger hot dog. Wow. So the pepper thing is not that hot. There is spice to it, but it's not that. Mucho caliente or nothing. This is a good hot dog. I didn't know they had fries and they're making me taste one of the french fries. 
Wow. The people here are just so nice, like, just so kind and friendly. Because even before, I was like, they were like, yo, you can just sit down and have something to eat. And I was like, yo, don't let me forget to pay and whatever. And they're like, yo, no problem. And yo, I really like the people here. The people here have been just great, like Mexican people in general. And I can just say, like, they're not as shy of the camera <laughs> as most people that I know. It's, like, really cool. I'm definitely having a great time here. Like the food, I can't wait for the other days to like explore other things and you know get the hang of you know doing this whole video thing and just enjoying it. Anyway, I'm about to leave the spot, go home, get some sleep. It was it was awesome. All right, gracias. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> wow, I enjoyed that. Like the people, <laughs> I can't say it anymore. I can't honestly. I, I really can't quite say much more about my experience um, here thus far. Um, I just paid. It was 48 pesos that I paid just now, which is like, uh, there goes my alarm. I did tell you guys that I, I should have, uh, let me stop for a second. Yeah, as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted. Um, I did tell you guys that I would have been up by 11, but I left like 30 minutes earlier. So yeah, that's why the alarm was going off. But um, yeah, it has been like super great. The people have been like super hospitable. Um, the food was pretty good. I mean, that might not have been typical Mexican food, but I like their their whole spin-off on, you know, an American famous thing, which is hot dogs, you know, and that was really good. But yeah, in general, like the hospitality has been like great. I'm just trying to get the whole hang of it, you know, as I said, like the whole hang of the people, you know, what their personalities are like, you know, what they, they will accept and not accept. Um, as I said, I spent like 48 pesos, which was like two dollars yeah for 50 pesos uh, it's like almost three bucks i believe in us dollars for that and i got a drink with a hot dog so factor that in that's really cool and um yeah i just need to really get the hang of like you know doing this whole filming thing because my whole setup this was kind of bulky to kind of you know relax and do what i was doing there you go a couple there one is riding a bike, the other one is skating by. I don't know what trees that hit in my head. <laughs> but um, yeah, that place is closed at 1 o'clock, as I did say before in another video. Uh, man, I don't know. I don't know, man. I could keep rambling, rambling on about the people here in Mexico, man. I could keep talking forever. But let me just end this video here. Um, thank you guys for following me on this video. I'm um, watching what I was doing. I'll go back there to try out a few of the other stuff maybe on a couple other nights I'll try out their their best dish there Which is probably the most expensive one I believe and try with some fries, but until then remember these three things guys love nature Adaptation and always remember keep the link